Hello everyone, welcome to this new tutorial on how to use or how to draw mechanisms in working model 2D. First of all, we must open the program. When the program opened, we gonna have this blank white page. First of all, in order to create a new file or a new working model sheet, we can just press Ctrl N or we go to file press new or we can just press here new okay here we're gonna see a white blank page to start we're gonna use these uh, six tools at the left for example we can draw a rectangle we can draw a square a circle anything we want I will delete this and this we're gonna use this at first okay we will draw another rectangle and one more rectangle okay now in order to add some element points we're gonna press at the point element here one at here another one here here these are the points that are most essential in this uh, in this shape for example for this first uh, rectangle we're gonna specify these two points this and this one in order to specify more points we can do that for example this point this point is not uh, as important as this point and this point so we don't specify them here, we just press on them and we delete them. We can also specify the point in the middle and X shape come to here when you uh, put, the, put the mouse on the middle or on the top or on the beginning of the tier or at the end of the tier. Okay, we just press on the arrow tool. Now we have this shape, this shape, and this shape. Okay. In order to, ma to merge this point with this point, we can just press on this one or this one. Then press Shift and press on this and go and make join. Okay. Okay. Now, in order to make this uh, this rectangle stay uh, not moving stay still or static we go and get this anchor tool and put it on it wherever we want now it is not moving as if we move this shape okay great now we're gonna use also for this one and this one the same tool this join okay we're gonna bring a pin join put it at the bottom of this one so it is now joined with the ground where's the ground the ground is this black is this uh, sorry uh, white space that you see okay now if you press run nothing will happen of course nothing will happen soon uh, because we do not have uh, any given or any input or any force well, it's all statics Okay, we'll press stop, then reset. Now we're gonna move this, not this one. This one, this uh, anchor, because we, we don't need it again. And we're gonna, we're gonna uh, need to add some input. The input come with the shape of motor. I'm gonna put a motor here. The motor turns this crank with a speed that we specify. Okay press uh, two times we press two times on the motor the velocity is here we gonna mess, uh, we gonna make the value of this motor of the speed uh, for example five radians per second okay five radians per second. now we're gonna press run you can see the moving of this mechanism press stop gonna make it some 
one, for example. Done. This is the way this mechanism is moving. Okay. Okay, we're back now. So we made a very simple mechanism that moves like this. This mechanism moves with the rotation of this motor. We attached a crank to this motor, which is this rectangle. We attach this rectangle to this rectangle with a pin joint. Then we attach another rectangle or another beam with this one with also a pin joint. This is a pin joint. Okay. When you attach a pin joint to the bottom of a beam or rectangle, it is automatically attached to the ground. So this one is attached to the ground. You can see from the running of this mechanism that this point speed is zero because it's attached to the ground. Okay. The same is here. When you attach a motor to a beam, the point on the motor does not move it is zero you can see that it is zero but this crank moves with a, a 360 degrees but this one does not move with 360 degrees it depends on the mechanism okay great let us add some beautiful things to this mechanism you can press on this go to window and appearance and choose the color we want this is a blue okay you can choose for this appearance and red and this one same thing go and paint it uh, light blue okay the same thing just uh, to be more